I'm glad somebody will use it. I was gonna throw it away and then I was like, I remember seeing somebody on there that says they would sell and I'm like, I wish you would just take it off my hands. I had a lady reach out to me on Facebook Marketplace looking to sell a whole bunch of her old video game stuff. She's got a Nintendo Wii, two Nintendo consoles with a whole bunch of games. She's got a PlayStation 3 with a bunch of games. Most of the games are pretty common, but there is one really expensive NES game worth like $140. She was only asking 200 bucks for all of this stuff. I didn't even try to negotiate because that's a really good deal. And yeah, we're going to go pick this stuff up. Hi. Hi. You're Jordan? Yeah, I am. Okay. For the video games, right? Yep. Did you want to pull into the driveway so you don't have to carry the stuff? Um, it's not that bad. It's just right there. I think okay. I got it. Should I come in or the garage or? Um, I have it right here. Okay. Here. You don't mind if I check some of this stuff no, out, do you? I don't mind. All right, cool. There you go. Okay. Like I said, I know nothing about it, so. Hold on. Well, I appreciate you reaching out to me. Yeah, let me just grab the rest. It looks like it's all here. I trust there you. There are the other games, the uh, Wii and the PlayStation. And then the game for this one is still inside here as well. Okay. It's never been open, so. Well, it looks like it's all been well taken care of, so I'll get you paid here. Perfect. There's 200 bucks for you, man. Amazing, thank you so much. Do you need help carrying it? You got it. I'll make a couple trips, okay. not a big deal. Perfect, thank you so much. Thank you. There's 200 bucks. We got a lot of stuff. There's a. Uh, Nintendo Wii with a bunch of stuff, PlayStation 3 and Wii games, all pretty common. We got a PS3 in the box, and then two Nintendos and a whole bunch of games. Nobunaga's Ambition 2, which is like a $130 game. Mike Tyson's Punch-Out. Should be two systems in here as well, one there, one below it. Lots of really good stuff. I'm going to lay all this stuff out and go over it more thoroughly back at the house. Back at the house, I just finished laying most of this stuff out, price charting some of it, and I want to show you guys exactly what I got. So we got a 320 gigabyte PlayStation 3 Slim in the box. It is the PlayStation Move Sports Champions Edition. Pretty cool to find that. I actually don't have any boxed PlayStation 3 consoles, so I might hold on to this one. I'm not quite sure yet. But all of the games with that were pretty common. We got some Lego games, some Madden games, FIFA, Disney Infinity. We also got this Disney Infinity box. And then down here we got Nintendo Wii. Most of the games are pretty common. All cheap stuff, unfortunately. But we do have Wii Sports, which is worth like 15 to 20 bucks. And we've got Mario Kart. Disc only, unfortunately, but I do have an extra case that I can put with this to complete it. Which is why I hang on to empty cases. And then over here we got the good stuff. The retro stuff, which is getting really tough to find. We got two NES consoles. Inside one of them was a bonus game, and that happened to be Mario Bros. 3. And it's a Left Bros, which is worth like 20 to 25 bucks. Label's a little bit beat up, unfortunately, but still a nice bonus find. We got five controllers with that, five NES controllers. Some pretty solid titles over here. Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, which is like 35 to 40 bucks. Paperboy is always a classic. Uh, Home Alone. Uh, Tecmo Super Bowl uh, World Championship Wrestling, which is like 15 bucks. This one's pretty beat up. So it's probably like 8 to 10 You always got to consider condition Then we got no bungas ambition and no bungas ambition 2 This is the best game in the whole lot 
and I definitely plan to hold on to it. Uh, this game alone is worth like $130 to $140 on eBay. This one's not in perfect condition. It does have a little bit of residue up here on the top and a little bit of fraying of the label. But it's pretty nice overall and I mean it's going to be free for the collection after I sell the rest of this stuff. I'm still going to turn a profit. So you can't really complain with free. So I'm definitely holding on to this one. Really excited to add this one to the collection. But yeah, all the rest of the games are pretty common. A couple of Mario Bro Duck Hunts, Tecmo Bowl, Dr. Mario, Wrestling, Jeopardy, a couple of Double Dribbles. Nothing too flashy here, unfortunately, but we did pull some pretty good stuff. So all of the stuff valued $10 or more in price charting comes to a total of $975.37. A uh, bunch of consoles. We got two Nintendo consoles, a Wii, PlayStation 3, some solid titles. Of course, a $140 game. And then down here, this stuff didn't get added to price charting either. It's just pretty common stuff. What I usually do with stuff like this is I bundle it with the system when I sell it locally. That just helps me get rid of it. This I didn't put into price charting, but I could probably put a couple of common games with it and still get, I don't know, 25, 30 bucks. Facebook Marketplace locally. So yeah, I spent 200 bucks on everything. After fees and shipping, I should be able to profit around 450 to 500 bucks. And I'll get to add a solid gem to the collection for free. That's how we do it. On to the next. About a month ago, I had a lady reach out to me on Facebook looking to just give away all of her Wii stuff. She said she was going to throw it away and she was happy that someone was willing to take it. Um, I went back through my Facebook messages and I was not able to find this conversation. So I can't put any screenshots up on the screen for you guys. You're just going to have to take my word for it. But yeah, it's a big box full of Wii stuff. Let's get into the footage. Hi. Hi. Are you the one with the Wii, I take it? Oh, that's a big box. All right. Do you want to look in it or just grab it I'll take a look. I'll take a look through it. Okay, so, I mean, there's just a whole slew of games. There's wheels, remote, there's Cabela's shooting in there. There's a console or two in there. I mean, there's nunchucks. Well, I'll definitely put it to good use, that's for well, sure. Well, good. I'm glad somebody will use it. I was going to throw it away, and then I was like, I remember seeing somebody on there that says they would sell it. I'm like, I wish you would just take it off my hands. Well, I definitely will. I appreciate you thinking Gosh, of me. Gosh, no worries. I didn't want to throw it away. So. <laughs> well, I appreciate it. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank Have you so much. Real quick, looks like a whole bunch of games. Mario and Sonic, Michael Jackson, Wii Sports, Mario Kart, Mario Bros, another Mario. I thought I saw a Mario Party in here somewhere. Another Mario Party. We play. There it is. Mario Party 9. I'll go over this stuff more thoroughly back at the house, but for free, definitely a steal of a deal. Alright, I just laid this stuff out. Really quick, I want to show you guys what I got and how much it's all worth. Um, the lady was literally about to throw it all away. She was happy that someone was willing to take it. But we got some good stuff. There's a Wii console with multiple controllers and nunchucks. We got four of the Mario Kart racing wheels. All of these games here are super common, like $10 or less. We got this random 3DS game that's sealed. Dogs Plus Cats Toy Poodle and New Friends. On price charting, this sealed is like 28 bucks, so that was a pretty nice surprise. We got three copies of Wii Sports, Mario Party 9, pretty much all of these are missing manuals, so I put them into price charting as loose, but we got Mario Party 9, Super Mario Galaxy, 
I said it before and I'll say it again, this is my favorite Mario game. Absolute favorite Mario game right here. Two copies of Mario Kart, Mario Sluggers, New Super Mario Bros, which I think I have a spare case for. I have to double check. Then we got Wii Sports Resort, Zelda Twilight Princess, Michael Jackson, and then Tiger Woods. This actually surprised me, the value of this one. Loose, it says this is like 18 bucks. But yeah, lots of really good stuff here. Lots of solid titles. The price charting total value comes to 37601. Some of the best stuff here is going to be the Wii system, of course, the controllers. That Nintendo sealed is $29. New Super Mario Bros. Loose 18. And then all of these games down here, we got Wii Sports Resort, Mario Karts, Sluggers, 28 bucks. That kind of surprised me as well. Mario Party 9 Loose 34. I find Mario Party 8 all the time, but Mario Party 9 is definitely more uncommon. But yeah, not a bad pickup for free. In retrospect, I probably should have kicked her 20 or 40 bucks, but it was a 40 minute drive each way, and she was just going to throw it away anyways, so I'm happy to take it. But yeah, on to the next. It's been a really killer week for pickups. I'm really excited to add Nobunaga's Ambition 2 to the NES collection. Pretty expensive game and for free after I sell everything. You can't go wrong with that. But that's going to be it for this video. As always, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And on to the next.